Hello everyone! Welcome to the 2022 National American Miss and I am Pageant Powerhouse vlog. Woo! It is Saturday morning. I wait for the airport today and these two spent the night to wish me well as I leave. Wow. Any, any words of wisdom? Yeah, smile and be yourself. If you don't win, that's just gonna be so disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> so let's hope for the best. Um, we're gonna get in the car and head to the airport. Hi everyone. So I'm gonna put this clip into the vlog after I do a little intro. So I don't like welcome you looking like this. Like I think that's a little much. But I just wanted to sit here and talk to you guys before the craziness of pageant week starts, um, which all starts a little later today. Today is November 19th, 2022. It's a Saturday and I officially fly to the 2022 National American Miss and I am pageant powerhouse, national pageant. Um, I'm actually going as Miss Wisconsin teen. Now saying that feels unreal and crazy still. I've had my title for three months and I like still can't wrap my mind around it. But I am so excited and so happy and just incredibly grateful for this opportunity. And I'm so ready to make every single moment at this pageant just magical. So I've competed in National American Miss for 10 years. I started when I was eight in 2012. I won my first title as a junior preteen at age nine in 2013. And of course I reigned for a year, went to nationals. It was great, I was super young, but I went back and gave up my title in 2014 and that was that. But I loved every second of it. I knew the second I gave up my title, I wanted to go back to try to win again. So I went back in 2015. Um, didn't place top five. I went back in 2016, finally made top five again, and I just went back every single year, making top five, not making top five, being first runner up, being third runner up. If you guys want a like little storyline about all of that, I posted throwbacks about every Thursday and Friday on my Instagram, on my at the Nam Wisconsin team. So you can check that out if you want to like read more about that whole journey. And I, I'm really proud of that little series I did because um, I think it turned out really nice and it tells a really personal and meaningful story about my journey with National American Miss and how it's been a crazy roller coaster. But this summer I went back for another state pageant and I had a different mindset this pageant. I really wasn't there to impress anyone. I wasn't trying, trying to be someone I wasn't. I wasn't over preparing. I honestly didn't even practice that much. Like I remember learning my intro a week before standing in lines at Universal Studios because I was on a trip with Jenna to the Bahamas and to Universal. And it was crazy like, but it all felt worth it and right when I got crowned, like everything lined up. And I remember the first thing I wanted to do was just look at myself in a mirror in that crown and banner because for seven years, imagine working towards something for seven years. What is something you work towards for something for seven years that isn't like a school degree? Like this is something that I put my heart and soul to everything I ever thought about during the summer was pageant related. And after seven years, it finally happened. Coming back to NAM year after year, I learned so many different things. And I think once I learned all those lessons I needed to, that is when God was finally like, all right, she's ready for this title. Because now I know that I'm truly going to be the best representative for Wisconsin that I can be at nationals this week. And that is something that I'm grateful for because it's a feeling I'm going to go in do my best and I know what I'm capable of and I know what and it's important to focus on and I think that is what I was waiting to realize until I won this title so that when I'm at nationals I can be the best representative I can be and get the best results for Wisconsin so I'm gonna save you my pity party because I could go on and on about how excited I am to go back and make my little nine-year-old self so proud I was actually watching 
the old finals videos from the last time I was at Nationals as Wisconsin for Nam. Yes. Good morning. <laughs> um, and I was actually crying because I was so like just happy, excited, emotional because this is my last Nam pageant. I have never said that on social media. Um, I competed for 10 years, and I think after this year, my my heels will be hung after that national this national pageant, just for NAM, just for NAM. Um, it's been a wild ride, but I reached my goal, and that's, that is all I've ever wanted. So I'm going to NAM this year to make my younger self proud and be happy and enjoy the moment. Ella, do you have any words of wisdom? Um, can I think about it? Sure. Is there coffee upstairs? No. Uh, There's a bubbler. Oh, okay, we made it to the airport. I've got all my luggage right here. But I'll show you in a second. But my mom is trying to like tuck them in. It's just so much to like move and carry. I cannot wait to ditch my big ones. Let me show you. Here's all my luggage. We got the two big ones and then some smaller ones here, but we're checking three of them and then the other three were, or the other two we're bringing on as carry-ons. So my mom is trying to figure that out, but we made it to the airport. the plane. I've got my crown banner on to board. It's been a rough little get go. I dropped my crown case. It cracked. My crown is missing a jewel. A really small one. Like I'm so overreacting but like my OCD for this pageant week has been crazy because I've worked for this for so long. So I just wanted everything to go perfectly. And like you know we're getting the kinks out now. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. So we're gonna board, I'm gonna get a picture with the pilot and it's gonna be great. We're boarded on the plane. Crown is seat buckled in. She's been through enough today, so she needed her own spot. We bought her one. Yeah, really good. We're taking off and we will see you guys once we land in Orlando. We made it to Orlando. Hi. I'm Miss Minneapolis teen. I'm competing for the All American teen title. I'm so excited. This is my first I am international, so it's gonna be great. So we're gonna go to baggage claim. How many bags do you have? I only we only each bought one checked bag, me and my brother. Absolutely. Yeah. I think I have four. <laughs> so, so. We're gonna go get our bags oh, and head to the hotel we're in the room we ordered chick-fil-a and now we're gonna go down and explore one of my favorite parts of pageant weekend so get ready for a montage
guys so we're back in the hotel room we ate our chick-fil-a it was so good i didn't even film it because i think i literally inhaled that faster than anything in my life but i thought i would give you a little hotel room tour welcome to my hotel here is a lot of my outfits that i needed to hang up they're just in the closet chilling until they need to be steamed and used a nice little mirror before you leave the door i got my hair extensions crown and banner my babies are just in there Got my junior preteen one, my teen crown, and my teen banner. Polaroid and more film. I think I want to take cute little pictures with the girls. Um, essentials kit, stain removers, because I, you know me, I'll get stains on everything. Hair and makeup and um, event schedule. Purse that I'll bring with me to a lot of my competitions. My NAM finder. I made this years ago, and I bring it to every single NAM thing. Portfolio book, portfolio, modeling cards, everything for callbacks accessories a really pathetic snack table it's so sad but i am gonna bust into these later over here we have all my earrings and jewelry that i'll be wearing this weekend a little station for all of that and then a little jacket station because i didn't have enough hangers and i wanted these hung up or laid out so i have my Wisconsin title holder jacket, a leather jacket, and then my state pride jacket. All of my shoes that I'm wearing this week. Uh, let's count how many pairs. 16 pairs of shoes. <laughs> That's a checklist of things I forgot. Happens. Makeup, hair, essential oils, love you to the moon and back. Skincare, me, mirror with a TV. Day one, done, it was fun. What? What? Oh! Means, prizes, yay, we got paid. <laughs> we just got paid okay, for our tickets. Okay. Good morning, everyone. It's hair and makeup time, day one. Do you want to introduce yourself? Yes, my name is Anna Voss. I'm currently the National American Miss. I'm giving it my title this week. I'm so excited to be here. Yes, bittersweet for sure. She was in the Indiana, Illinois State vlog. So if you haven't watched that one, go watch that one. Um, we're getting hair and makeup done, and Anna has coffee, and I'm so jealous. I need some right now. What is it? What is it? Oat milk. All right, that's where we're going next after we we finish this. Hi everyone. So we are getting ready to check in. Here's the check-in fit. I'll show you better later. But we have a special guest. Hi, my name is Bear Murphy, and I'm your National American Miss Houston teen, and I'm such a big fan of her vlogs. <laughs> what are you most excited for this whole week? I hear the neon party is very exciting, and the universal photo picture, mm -hmm. since we're like the first group to do it. Yeah, it's going to be great, so. Here's the check-in yeah. line. But the exciting week begins. photo shoot my mom is steaming a couple things we're checked in and we're ready to go let pageant weekend begin <laughs> 
I am Co Susan, your International Junior Miss United Kingdom. Yes! <laughs> so we are here. I've checked in. She's gonna check in. I've got a photo shoot with Brittany Link. Have you? Yes, oh I'm so excited. So I'm heading back to hair and makeup, but we will keep you guys updated. Bye. Yes. Bye guys. The rain never cancels a Britney Link shoot. We no. can do it all. We just do it all. We just do it all. So we're outside of the hotel right now shooting with the amazing Britney Link. And I'm so excited, so happy. We're doing so well. We just wrapped. They're so fantastic. <laughs> it's like raining so hard. It's, you would never know. Like <laughs> the Florida weather is not working with us, but we're doing okay. But it was actually such a vibe. Like sneak peek, sneak peek. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. I'll put all the pictures in. I'll even put in our headshots we did a cut like a month ago. They're so People good. are going crazy. People like oh, they're, they're just so like good. so pretty, you know. Well, it was just the <laughs> photographer was so good. It was the team. It's always it the, the team, team effort. Yeah. It was the team. <laughs> So I'm here with Vinia Fode, I'm Miss Urbandale, Iowa, and I'm National All American Miss. Yes! Escort rehearsal. Escort rehearsal, very fun. I just practiced my ta talent routine on the stage. This gorgeous girl is going to rehearsal and she is representing Iowa phenomenally. So go kill it, girl, have fun, and we'll check in later. Just got done with kickoff. Pageant weekend is officially started. I'm so excited. It was so fun, so cute. Here's the fit. Love. Now it's Nia party time. So excited. Let's go get changed. Oh my gosh. Look at my door. Ah. Who did this? Trisha and Tori. I know. It's so cute. 
We're heading to Neon Party, and it's this girl's birthday. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Hi, guys, my name's Savannah, and I'm your Miss Libertyville Junior Team. Woo! To the Welcome Neon Party, and I'm so excited. You might have seen me in other vlogs because yes. I used to be the Miss Illinois preteen. There's a she whole vlog of your farewell. Hi everyone, we're at the neon party. We got Meredith. Tierney. Tierney. I'm a teacher. Yay! Woo! So fun. Oh. Okay, so this vlog will probably be seen in like August. Yeah. So happy in summer August. everybody. <laughs> you know, it might be a little bit delayed, but I'm just letting you know that even though you Meredith are gonna be watching this well. in the summer. I know. vlog hello hello it's day two it's time for competitions so excited i have fun fitness this morning just got my hair and makeup done i love it fitness barbie is here i'm gonna go change into my leggings i got my sports bra on but i've just got to get my leggings on and then me and tiff are gonna practice because we want to feel as good as we can before going in but i'm excited i feel good i got coffee this morning i feel ready set to go excited Let's do this. fresh face time. I feel like I'm in New York right now. Like this is just such a classic like New York action week fit, but like no. We're bringing New York to Orlando. I'm going back to hair and makeup to get my hair done for fresh face and then we compete at like 315. Here's the fit. I'm so excited. Got my model bag. We're gonna head down. I'm not sure the last time I updated you, but I just did fresh face. It went, it went super well. I, it went super well. I'll put a video in 
if I get one from Tiffany's mom. But now we have rehearsal. It's the Ashley Loren themed rehearsal and we film a little videos. So I'm wearing my opening number dress and I'm gonna go get my hair and makeup touched up. So everything I need and my cute little swag and I'm so excited. I think it's going really well. Like I just feel cool and like confident and like I think it's gonna pay off. So. It's the official first rehearsal of NAM Nationals <laughs> Week. We have all of our fellow teens here. I finally get to meet everybody. I know, it's crazy. We're here. <laughs> vlog collab. This is our vlog collab. <laughs> hey vlog, look at her cute phone case. Okay, play. Go watch Lucia's vlog. What's your channel? Just Lucia Fang, I think. Love it. Okay, go watch it. What, what's your channel? Addie Christine. Okay, go watch her vlog, you guys. So fun. <laughs> But it's time to get glam. Ready? Hair and makeup is done. Loki obsessed with it. I love it. I'm getting Starbucks. So I'm dying. So excited. I just got my coffee. Major update for the vlog. This is major. They have officially switched to bamboo straws. That is huge. Are you kidding me? If I remember, I'm gonna put in the clips of paper straw from two years ago. That was tragic. Not anymore. I saw Brienne down at the market. Love her to death. Brienne is my state director. Best state director in the world. Not even kidding. We love her. I have to go get changed and then go back down to hair makeup in a bit. So, and then we start competing. Yay! Hey vlog, we're getting ready for actress. <laughs> okay, we're here with all of the wonderful girls. I'm Sarah Beth and I'm from Branson, Missouri. I'm Ainsley and I'm the California team. I'm Hannah Carson from Blacksburg, Virginia. I'm Kennedy Holt from Snowmats in Georgia. Yay! So we're doing actress right now. We go up and say like a little commercial. There's the stage right there. And there's some Macy. But we're gonna kill it. It's gonna be so fun. And for a second take, action in three, two, one.
casual wear, except I need my jacket and my hair redone. So we're heading back to hair and makeup right now. I really want to nail my routine in casual wear. I don't know if I, me and Shreya came up with such a good, well, she came up with it. It was her routine. Um, casual routine, and I just want to nail it to make her happy. So, fingers crossed that I can do it. I love the outfit, though. I'm so excited. Number 56, Addie Kaney. Number 50. Oh, we did runway, we nailed runway. Now we have a two and a half hour rehearsal and it's state pride game. So I'm going back to here and make it to get touched up before just to feel a little bit more revamped. And then we're going to rehearsal. So fun. Bree's ready for the stage. Kind of like the, like the mermaid. Reminds me of the fish from Shark Tales. I feel like it is. It's her luxurious yes. hair and it's crimped. But it doesn't. Good morning vlogs. Oh my goodness. It is Wednesday, which is callback morning. I got seven agency callbacks and a callback for face of Ashley Renee's. Kara called me this morning. I didn't have a hair or makeup schedule time because I wasn't gonna get my hair and makeup done. I was just gonna do it myself. She called me and she's like, get down here. And I was like, I'm coming. And now I'm running. Hey guys. So 
fitty check and changed into some comfy clothes, looking better than ever. And we're going to Universal. I don't know if I told, I think I filmed a really quick vlog clip of me heading down to hair and makeup. But I got an Ashley Renee's callback and that's huge. And I'm so happy it went so well. And we find out if I got the job later this week. I also got like seven different agency callbacks, but I ended up meeting with like, 10 different agencies, so those all went really well. And I'm excited to be in contact with them. How those kind of work is I will just continue to stay in contact with them after this week and we will continue to talk and see what will happen. But today's my free day, so we are gonna leave the hotel and we're gonna go to Harry Potter World. I'm so hyped. yesterday it's been a crazy whirlwind of a journey or since so my mom ended up getting a headache last night at Universal so we left pretty quickly and then came back to the hotel and then top five optionals were announced and so I was anxiously waiting they were posted 20 minutes late which was like so stressful but I ended up making top five in talent casual wear and actress and I get to recompete those at the NAMIs. And I'm so excited. I can't believe it. It's gonna be so fun. Now I'm going to the birthday party rehearsal. I'm so excited. It's early in the morning. I don't even have my hair and makeup done because my hair and makeup time isn't until 10. There's lots of things to do today. We have formal wear and then car drawing, but I have to get my new gown. I have to get my hair and makeup done. That's just for my dad. Lots of things. So it's gonna be a good day. enjoys theater and dancing. For her national community involvement, she volunteered at local theaters to promote arts in small communities. It's her goal to work professionally in the performing arts industry. She's Hattie Koenig, Miss Wisconsin. There they are, ladies and gentlemen. How about one more big round of applause for... I watch her vlog, she watched my vlogs. It's just like a Full vlog co-op. I have a vlog on my Snapchat story, does that count? Yes. yes. Okay. Vloggers, I'm also right here. a vlogger. Love it. <laughs> I didn't win a call.
Aww. Me okay. neither. Yeah. I mean, no. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. A junior presentation. Well, yeah. that's classic. Yeah. That's just yeah. classic. Yeah. So. But it's okay. Oh, well, next time. Next Maybe time. next year. Yep. Lots of thumbs up at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, so I just wanted to come in. I haven't been vlogging much today. Um, it's kind of been a chaotic day. Um, and I just wanted to be real and raw and open with you guys because I don't want to hide any part of my journey through anything on this channel. Um, as you know, I've competed for this title for seven years. And then today I represented Wisconsin in formal wear. Um, and I came off the stage and I was not happy with my performance at all. I got a new gown at the beginning of the week and it's the gown that I wanted and I'm not sure if that was a good idea or a bad idea because I love the gown but my walk was just not the same. The dress was just a little long, a little too low, like it just, it wasn't my strongest walk and I knew that I could have done better. Uh, I'm a really strong believer in that everything is predetermined, everything happens for a reason. Obviously, you can do things to change your fate, your destiny, whatever you want to call it, but I am upset with how I did. I, I feel like I could have done a lot better, but I also know that there's a reasoning behind it, and I'm going to try to stick with that. I've got two more competitions. I'm not counting out myself out of this competition yet. Don't, I cannot think like that. I can't afford to think like that at this point, um, so... I'm just going to keep going strong, performing my best, and letting what happens happen. Um, Gown is back at alterations, hoping that it gets a little better before final show. Um, but what's meant to be is meant to be, and it won't pass me up. And I'm just happy to be here, and I need to flip my mood back around because I've been kind of a little drag all day because of that. We had the car drawing earlier today. I did not win the car. Three for three years in a row, never won the car, but you know, it was still fun. I was supposed to go out to dinner with my family, but they announced that they will be um, sharing who the new face of Ashley Renee's is at the Thanksgiving banquet. So I'm going to go pop in there just because I did get a call back for them and I want to be there if the, they end up choosing me. So we're going to go down there and then I'll probably head back up to the room and change and go to bed early because I need some rest. Um, after today, I just need to let myself decompress and I can be upset with how I did, but I can't let it affect how I perform in other areas. So I know this was a long, really boring, gross clip, but I wanted to come on and share it with you guys. So I'm heading down to the banquet right now. I'll try to get some footage there. Here's my cute little outfit. I do love it. Um, and I'll update you guys soon. Hi guys, Hi. where are we? We are at the Thanksgiving banquet for me. Are you getting, do you have any awards that are announced tonight? Oh. No, we just go on the Yeah, how did you do, tell the vlog. I got first runner up international talent. I got top 20 actress and top 20 runway. Yes, so good. Abby, tell the vlog how you did. What? How you did in optionals. Oh, I got first runner-up casual wear for Nam. I got first runner-up top model for Nam. Third runner-up runway for Nam. And fourth runner-up fun fitness for Nam. It's amazing. They did so good. Mine award ceremony hasn't happened yet. My red carpet is on Saturday. It is? Yeah. Why, is it, why are they waiting so long? I don't know. And my yeah, final tomorrow. show, final show, or tomorrow I have an interview in the morning and a rehearsal and then eight hours of nothing. Oh, and I swear, if I'm upset after my interview, yeah. I'm going home. I when is your final show? It's tomorrow. Tomorrow's your final show? Yeah. What time? Um, 7. PM? Yeah. I'm coming. I'm coming. Do you have a award winner? morning vlog so I'm heading down to hair and makeup it's like 5 a.m. I have an interview today and I'm gonna make it the best interview of my life that's my goal 
Last night we had the Thanksgiving banquet and they announced Face of Ashley Lays. A very sweet girl, Ramona, won it. She was a national queen a couple years back. Absolutely gorgeous. Congratulations. And little Emmy, the Iowa princess, won the, the little division for it. So that was really exciting. I had a lot of fun with my friends last night at the banquet, so that was really nice. Um, today all we have is interview and rehearsal. And then I have a lot of free time and I'm probably going to sleep, maybe go out with my family to Disney Springs a little bit, but it's going to be a good day and I'm excited. We're leaving yesterday in the past. It is what it is. There's nothing you can do about now except kill it in the future. So let's do it. It's almost time to interview for the dream job. I'm changed and ready. I'm heading back down to hair and makeup to get revamped. But here's the fit. I love it. I have to press my floor. I always forget to do this because the elevator in New York, you don't have to do that. Um, I love it. I'm so excited. Cool, calm, confident, and perfect. I'm so ready. Hi. Interview time. We're in the waiting room. Doing all the things. You're on TikTok. Just <laughs> decompress. <laughs> So fun, so ready for interview. Moving forward. Again, this is a no particular order. Ladies, make sure to step on up when you hear your name and follow your choreographer. The first to make the top five, Seth Tuxi. Seven. Yay. I am going down to hair and makeup right now because we have the red carpet awards this morning. So I get to recompete my three optionals. I'm so excited. I've always wanted to recompete at the Nammies. Well, they used to be called the Nammies. Now they're called the red carpet awards. I've always wanted to compete and now I get to do it three times. I'm so excited. So I'm heading down there. You know, ready. So I have to care about some hair switches that I need to do. And then, yeah, it's gonna be great. So excited. Hi, vlog. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> I love your vlogs. They're oh, amazing. thank you. I'm such a big fan. So, um, <laughs> we'll talk about this later, but introduce yourself. Hi, yes. I'm Caitlin Dutcherville. I am the former National All-American Miss for the year 2016. <laughs> and I'm here to compete, well, not compete, hand out awards Yes. at the Red Carpet Awards, That's so make so sure you guys watch. <laughs> well, you're like a celebrity because you have this gorgeous thing on. <laughs> so that is awesome. Miss Red Carpet Awards are starting right now. I just had mine. We'll go over everything oh in gosh. the room. I'm so excited. <laughs> and, um, and congratulations to you for winning thank you. actress. Thank you. Oh my God, that's amazing. Well, go kill it. Go hand out those awards. Yes. It's going to be great. Mm -hmm. I guys we're heading back to hair and makeup we have um introductions tonight so i have to get really up i took a nap cried a little bit just, i don't know why um and i need a revamp for sure
is either a daring adventure or nothing at all, and I'm certainly not afraid to step out of my comfort zone. A triple threat, actress, singer, and dancer. I've been in over 14 theater productions and plan to perform my life all the way to the big screen. Channeling my hometown roots in Luck, Wisconsin, with some added determination, of course, you can say I am ready to see my name amongst the stars. As a freshman at the Savannah College of Art and Design, I've been a lifelong advocate of arts education. In fact, it is my mission to show individuals just how capable they are through the arts, regardless of where they come from. From modeling in New York Fashion Week, swimming with dolphins in the Bahamas, to auditioning for America's Got Talent while dancing on a hoverboard, what's life without a little adventure? Honored and lucky to be your Miss Wisconsin teen, I am Abby Koenig. <laughs> we just did intro. Yay, we're done. Yes, I did so well. I'm sorry. And we're going to do so well at that show. Coming from the state where cheese isn't just for eating, it's also a fashion accessory. Representing Wisconsin, I am Abigail Koala. Just like before my state final, I wanted to come on here and talk to you guys. I can't even believe that this week is already over. It went by so fast. And this is something I've dreamed of doing since I was nine years old. I wanted to come back and represent Wisconsin nationally. And I have been with this system. National American Miss for 10 years. It's been a part of me for 10 years. And I am just so, so grateful to be able to grow and have, I've grown with the system. I've seen the system grow. I've, I've been here for it all. And I'm grateful that I got this opportunity. Going into finals, I'm not gonna lie, I am nervous. I'm not even sure why I'm nervous because if I'm being 100% honest, I don't expect the title at all. I am hoping to make top 12. That was one of my goals coming into the week, but Shreya sent me a text earlier today and she reminded me that I had already reached my goal. My goal was to win Miss Wisconsin team and I did that. And I know at the end of this week I get to go home and I get to represent Wisconsin for the next eight months to my best potential and I know I will do that. So no matter the results, I know that what is meant for me will not pass me by. I know that it's all in God's hands no matter what the results are. And I know that they will be met for everyone. I have a meeting with Mark, the head agent, and then I have hair and makeup, and then it's time to get the night started. I'm just gonna enjoy it. I'm just going to live in the moment and take in my time of representing Wisconsin on that national stage. Okay. Last time in hair and makeup before finals. That'll start in two hours. Do you guys want to be in the vlog? <laughs> <laughs> These are our amazing hair and makeup artists with Team Mascara. We love it. I'm so excited. Okay. I do need some light though. Oh, there <laughs> we lost power. Wow. Let there be light. Let there. So. Nope. Oh.